Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how to use Google Play Music. Google Play Music is an app for listen to music, it's similar to Apple Music. What is it good, what is it different from different apps? This is gonna show you, this is gonna let you to listen to music online. You can actually also save it to your device, but it is cost money. It's gonna cost about ten dollars a month, but I think it's totally worth it. This is how you can access your music from every device, and nothing gonna be lost. So let's start. What do we have here? This is the main screen we'll get into first. You sign in. Okay, I already paid, so this is the way you you see. Uh, now we are on the first option on the menu listen now and as you can see here uh, Google recommends it's Wednesday evening play something for you can choose it's gonna keep changing according to the time and the day so you can just listen to a radio or playlist you can choose anything you want I don't use it so much next thing is recent activity this is gonna show you all your recent activity so you can access uh, stuff that you are using frequency more easily next thing is recommended for you this is uh, things that Google think you will be interesting according to your previous songs now what else do we have here is top charts top charts is the top hits what everyone listened to now here you can see this is you got songs you got albums um let's see let's say you would like to listen to that one I'm just gonna press on that you will play see right now he's on the bottom you can press it and it's gonna open up the full player um, now let's say you liked that song okay and you want to add it to a playlist this is what I don't gonna pause it sorry let's say you like the song you want to add it to a playlist this is what I the way I use the app I'm doing a lot of playlist for everything or every other activity the way this is easier for me so what you want to do is press on the menu here on the top do add to playlist now I already added a lot of playlist but you will have nothing here so you're gonna do new playlist you can choose the name let's say top hits you can describe if you want to add a description you don't have to and the next option is public if you want other people to see it i always do public because i do like to listen to others people music and why not and then you hit create playlist and you can see one song added to top hits pretty cool what you can also do is just or press back or can swipe it to the down uh, next thing you have on the menu is new releases. New releases is uh, all the songs that came out, brand new. Next thing is a music library, which is the most important thing in the app. This is all the playlist, songs, everything you have been <coughs> that yours actually, not yours, but like yours, okay. So, as you can see here, you have playlist, stations, artists, albums, songs, and genres. Oh, that's, that's pretty common. Now, this is the top hits. You remember that? You, we created a new playlist. You will always have recent playlist, as you can see here, and auto playlist, which is thumbs up if you liked one, or last added, which is songs that you add it and all the playlists 
Now, what I want to show you is how to use the playlist. So you press on that, and you see here the download button. I'm just gonna press over here. Okay, you can see this one. This is will let you to download the playlist, uh, which gonna save you data because all the song gonna save on your device. You will you can listen while on the plane and just if you want to save data it's also gonna load faster so you're just gonna press on that and it will download sometimes you will need to wait for a wi-fi depends on your settings and what else i want to show you is what you can do on a specific song okay you saw i'm just gonna on the full player again press the menu you also have go to artist which is pretty cool if you like a specific artist let's say you like the weekend go we'll go to artist and he will show you all of his songs that's pretty cool another thing is add to album or share this is what I'm gonna show you till what else you have here is Repeat, you can repeat a specific song or repeat the whole playlist. You have cast, I'm going to explain you that in a different video. And you have shuffle, which is, will shuffle your songs. And thumbs up, all the thumbs up will be on the playlist, automatic playlist or dislike. Which is also if you want to do that. Okay, I'm just going to hit back again. I don't think that very cool about this app is the search okay you can of course search everything you like but the most cool is identify what's playing which is like shazam if you know that will recognize your the song that is on the room and press on that and it will listen to the music That's gonna be it for today. Uh, if you like my videos, you can subscribe. And if you have any comment or question, you can hit me. Have a good one.